Uh, how can a new graduate stand out in the field with no experience, having transitioned from another field? Uh, what is a good way to get practical experience while obtaining a master's degree? Uh, my master's degree in biostatistics was at the uh, was at Washington University in St. Louis, which is a very prominent uh, research uh, facility. And so what we were able to do as uh, future biostatisticians while we got our degrees was to offer our support to those uh, investigators at the hospital. And so we helped them work on their projects. So any evidence, any body of evidence that you can generate while you work towards your master's is going to go the distance. So find uh, some uh, investigator out there who's conducting their own research and offer your services or even better, go to your administrative office uh, for whichever university you go for your master's program and ask them for help. Say, hey, I, you know, I really want to get practical experience. Uh, can you hook me up with an investigator so I can help support their analysis? Or do you have any biostatisticians that have graduated through this program that I could help support and learn from uh, throughout the way? But really, the way to stand out once you graduate your master's degree is to, because everybody else is going to have a master's degree in biostats, the, the way to stand out is to say, I also have this body of evidence. I've also done some work before. Here it is. Uh, that, that'll go the distance there. Anything yeah. to add on that, Justin? I just add that um, a lot of universities have uh, like a kind of statistical consulting bureau um, to help researchers mm -hmm. or, or grad students. Um, so if there's one, reach out to the person that's managing it, usually it's going to be a statistician. And um, I'm sure that if you show interest, I think you have a good chance of maybe kind of getting closer to that work and uh, maybe having hands-on experience come out from there.